Turbocharger and a carburetor do not work all that flawless together, but it doesn't mean they cannot. Most of the time there is a fuel injection, mechanical or electronic, but there are a few where there isn't. There is a carburetor before the turbo, called a draw-through system, and imagine that there is an air-fuel mixture being pressurized together in the turbo. Ford Mustang Cobra The late 70s Mustang wasn't anyhow fast even with a V8. There was a fuel efficient 4 cylinder Pinto engine with around 90 horsepower, but then Ford decided to put a Garrett Air Research Turbo on it. Torque wise it got into the V6 territory, but the power was just slightly down compared to the V8. Oldsmobile Jetfire F85 The Oldsmobile F85 wasn't all that slow with a stock 3.5 litre engine and 155 horsepower in case of the small compression ratio version. However, it got interesting and wrote down its name in bold into the history book when it received a turbocharger. As the first factory turbo car, it needed the MW50 mixture to prevent engine knocking. Chevrolet Corvair The Corvair lineup bottomed out a 2.3 litre 80 horsepower engine with a sketchy swing axle rear suspension, whereas the top of the range model featured a turbocharged power plant with 185 horsepower and an improved independent rear suspension. Interestingly, the Turbo Corvair was released just one month after the jet fire. Buick Regal Sport Coupe The famous and beautiful Buick Regal Grand National featured the same 90 degree even firing V6 as the Regal Sport Coupe, however it was fed by a 2 or 4 barrel carburetor in the Sport Coupe. There was also a firmer suspension, larger wheels and bucket seats to enhance the sporty feeling. For the 1982 model it gained 25 more horsepower. Pontiac Turbo Trans M The Turbo Trans M was a great example that a carburetor does not work all that well with a turbocharger. The fuel system simply could not use all the potential of the Garrett unit as it pushed just 9 psi boost. The engine base was great though, there were forged pistons and high pressure oil pump to cope with the added performance. <laughs> 